It says, 50 Cent has been hyping up his Diddy documentary for months, and he wasn't trolling his arch enemy. As the project just landed a prestigious new home, TMZ has learned. Multiple sources familiar with the situation tell TMZ 50's multi-part docu documentary about the sexual assault allegations against Diddy was purchased by Netflix. <laughs> We're told there was a massive bidding war over the doc, which was produced through 50 mm. Cent's G-Unit Film and Television Studios, with multiple networks and all of the streaming platforms attempting to land the series. Ultimately, the big red in emerged the victor, with sources telling TMZ the new Diddy docuseries will hit the streamer. I'm sorry. The new Diddy docuseries will hit the streamer sooner than later. The documentary couldn't be timelier. The, the rap mogul was hit with another civil lawsuit Tuesday with model Crystal McKinney accusing Diddy of sexual assault in her in 2003. See, bro, it's mm. over, She bro. came forward after 2016 security footage of Diddy beating the ex-Cassie in a hotel hallway surfaced Friday. Oh. Cassie previously accused Diddy of abuse and sexual assault last year and settled out of court one day later. Floodgates mm -hmm. over. Floodgates Bam! over. Four Let years from now, Diddy flow. gonna be Let the bodies hit the flow. Trying to get on the podcast. If <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if another lawsuit came. They're coming, bro. That's he the floodgates are open. He said the floodgates. That's are two open. that I know <laughs> of since that Cassie shit, nigga. That's mm -hmm. two that She's I know. To talk of about some shit from twenty one years ago, and mm -hmm. even if the time then passed to where it, it could be, it's just her story alone is gonna be enough to affect this nigga. It's a in court, they ain't gonna want to fuck with him. But in court, so, like I said, motherfuckers yeah. can't forget that video of him throwing Cassie and doing yeah. all that shit. Motherfucker yeah. ain't gonna forget what this bitch say. Motherfuckers is most definitely not gonna be able to forget this Fifty Cent docu series, and you know he ain't gonna let you. Hey, this and it, you bro. Hey, I fucks with her. If it go, if it, if it, that nigga if need no any, petty. Ain't if it's hope. anything, hey, fifty to go. If it's anything like power. <laughs> Anything like raising Canaan, anything like what? <laughs> what? Anything I mean, like I'm the OJ saying, shit. I ain't saying like 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 that, mean but like I mean wise, like production wise. like production wise and like <laughs> oh my god, if it's the it's, direct direct the directory, excuse me. I think it's gonna be people on right. there confessing and telling on this nigga. Yeah, it's gonna be another famous, um, famous surviving, people gonna be on there. It's gonna be surviving story Diddy. about how Diddy booty raped him. Man, this is about to be epic. 50, <clears throat> 50 is my hero at this point, bro. That, I always, like, it's crazy because, yeah, like, I always do. consider 50 an asshole, bro. Like, and right he's about, that, he right, he know how that. to get paid off of it. Right about now, he bro. He, he is my hero. He <laughs> how to sure. Like, for real. For sure. He know how to get paid off of that shit. You know, being an asshole really ain't nothing but another form of cockiness, though. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like it's, I've, I know cocky. Maybe, maybe. They, I'm telling you, they go hand in hand. <clears throat> but maybe yeah, fifty. It's maybe, a fine line, maybe, I guess. Maybe fifty is just the one to undermine the all the ones who've been feeling like they're the gorillas <clears throat> anyway. I think fifty. Just like I don't go. I like you know what I'm saying. Like, like. I don't want to go this route, but we can. I'm gonna go this route, right? Like, so on a biblical note, you know what I'm saying? King David was on a smaller statue. I don't think 50 don't want to don't go this route. I think that nigga is waiting for somebody to. He so wants we to go this. Let's go this route. He wants to go that route. Whoever. But he's mm -hmm. been trying to. He's been that them niggas. Yeah. He's been he dropping been, shit. Yeah. And trying to, so now that the floodgates, he's he, he's on the attack. Yeah. Respect. You know what I'm saying? I respect so you at, for that. And, 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 and 50 for no, real, for real, has been lot. undermined when it comes to Diddy. Or Jay Z type shit. So for real, for real, that's just me seeing him on the rise. He the one that he was. The, he the New York King that been on the bottom. Mm. So now he the real, and because he now you get one that ain't been fucking around on no gay shit or what, ain't you feel what I'm saying? Ain't none mm -hmm. of that. Otherwise, he wouldn't be doing the shit that he's doing right now, knowing that it's some dirt on him to be. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So, so but know. and a lot of other things like you, you see fifty. Uh, Buying up, buying up all these properties and shit. You know what I'm saying? And building his own studios and shit. He damn near on some Tyler Perry shit right bro, about now, bro, bro. bro. And where he, he and where he did that at? Tell him where mm -hmm. he did where he did that at. Where did he do that at? I don't. 
and he did that in in, in Oklahoma, bro, where black the black a uh, black Wall Street was originated. So with. that's okay. So he built that, the, that's the what, right. studios okay. down there where they burnt. See, we had a we had our own Wall Street. Okay, and it got burned down in like. So he's rebuilding Black Wall Street. Well, he built the studios. He built where the studio Black where Street, Black Wall, Wall Street used to be. Where it, yeah, that's hard. Yeah, man, and that's a that, and that's a historic place. But if a lot of people don't know nothing, like, that's we ain't tough. got time to go into it. But Google or do your research on Black Wall Street. Now, see, I hadn't, I ain't know where he actually built it at. Yeah, but I knew he was. You know what I'm saying? On his way, on some, on some <clears throat> mastermind shit. You Wait know what till I mean? that stars deal over with, mm. and, and and the G Unit app come out. That's you think crazy. that's where he coming next? Bro, Black Wall that's Street. Smart. Do y'all know how big that is? We're gonna take off. Like the show what? What? To his like, own app. Yeah, that's smart as fuck. Mm, because mm, mm, mm. he didn't already motherfucking swung his opinion, um, entertainment wise. Like he's already put up. Nothing but three, like you feel me. And you see, it's so like you already know what you're gonna get. Where I put you this go. at? Everywhere I put it. Fuck it. Let's, y'all, y'all want y'all want this on Hulu? Fuck it. Come on, I got a show for Hulu. Come on, huh? Y'all got Netflix? Ooh, I've been waiting on Netflix. Come on, you know I've been fucking with Netflix yeah. for years. Look, I got this, doc, this Diddy documentary. I know y'all got that bag for me. Right. Stars, come. On. You know that. that don't really. You know that Tariq out. dropping coming. Come, you know that Tariq dropping stars. Yeah. Chill out, bro. You know, hey, well, you feel me? Like niggas yeah. everywhere. So imagine once he get all his. Shit on one Up under one. I gotta, app. I gotta come back next week, bro. We, I gotta r- talk about this some more, bro. He just, some more Diddy. I mean, bro, he, some more he just bought a historical landmark. Are you kidding me, bro? Do you bro, look up, Black bro? Wall like it? What? <coughs> look up Black Wall Street, bro. How many black people own historical landmarks? Shit, Shit him and, and such Tyler as Perry that at this moment. <coughs> I don't know, bro. We talking Black Wall Street, bro? Come on, bro. Like, yeah. Like Black Wall, people don't even understand that. If, if, if people understand what Wall Street is to the America right now, that's what Black Wall Street was to all I'm gonna say is Black folks. All I'm gonna say is Fifty bet not fuck this up and end up like the niggas we talking about. But y- hell nah, his integrity too. Nah, I don't, I don't think I don't, I don't think, think he's that. I've refused to believe that. But let me ask you this: What do you? expect from this docu-series like do you expect it to be like um because a docu-series is a documentary that's broken down (laughs) into i think (coughs) i think everybody that damn had an encounter with him Mm -hmm. gonna have their own episode so look this is what i want to know so what do you call the oj simpson story that came out with cuba gun jr what would that be considered is that what oh, a docu series is? That. Yeah, it is. It is. So the Jeffrey Dahmer yeah, shit is a docu series. Yes. It, so yeah. somebody so we about to get this shit in TV oh, show yeah. form. Oh, somebody, yeah. somebody oh playing, my god! Somebody's playing Diddy. Yeah. Who do you think or, gonna be Diddy, or, y'all? Or, or, same nigga or, that was Diddy. To be honest, and, and, uh, uh, Surviving R. Kelly is B.I.G. Surviving R. Kelly is a docu series too. So you, I mean, this is different. That's what I'm asking. That's what I'm asking. You know what I mean? That's what I was. So I don't know how the format is gonna be. Type format. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Yeah. I would I would assume I, if, I if, feel like I would I would be so amazed if he came like on some surviving R. Kelly shit like Yego was saying, like get the line these motherfuckers up and interview them. You know what I mean? I, but I feel so like look, that would be more realistic f- compared for what's yes. going on. You could do that type of shit later. Mm-hmm. But right now we need facts. Hold on. Wait. So is BMF I mean, considered a docu series? No, that's 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 just a I a so. TV show because it's not it's, it's not on, all, it's based, it's based on, on the these, true story, but it's not all facts. That's what I'm saying. Uh, we the, don't the need the BMF it series. It's not we all don't facts. need that shit fictionalized. Jeffrey Dahmer wasn't all facts neither. BMF actually has a a, a documentary. Uh, yeah, that's an actual side, documentary the though. Of the show. That's an actual documentary though. Yeah. But we're talking about docu series because everything in Jeffrey yeah, Dahmer see. wasn't see a hundred percent. I would no see the Jeffrey the, Dahmer shit with the Netflix joint. That's just a show. Um, yeah, you know, BMF they tell you that's that what, too. Like some it's based shit, on the true story. I don't think lightning, all the uh, everything that happened these, it didn't it didn't go down exactly how that how it went down in that Jeffrey Dahmer shit, if you will. But these are these events are based. That's on, probably on the what truth. don't make it a docu series because yeah. some of the people's names is fictionalized and shit all like that. All of that kind of shit. But yeah. everybody from the Cuba Gooding shit, the the OJ Simpson shit, everybody was real. the yeah. I'm really OJ Simpson. This is really um, Nicole Simpson. This mm-hmm. is really 
The yeah. motherfucker she was cheating on. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, so that, that yeah. might be the difference. Like yeah. it's as closely to the facts now, as see, possible. Yeah, based on real live events. Yeah, and because the Henrietta some, bitch from BMF can't be real, bro. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, she cannot be a real person. Mm-mm. Now to see that BMF, that's that's just a show. Like somebody they they wrote a script. You know what I'm saying? And they probably got some real stories in there but like you said they Change put some different names, names on it and add a little names. twist to certain situations you know what i'm saying so it's all right so for shits and giggles let's say that they come in tv shows for him. who would you want to see play diddy the only nigga antoine fisher you think he did the diddy justice hell yeah might as well be. Yeah, I mean, because it ain't been no other. Who other, else is it? That it ain't been Diddy? no other Diddy. Impression. Give me some more examples, cause I don't yeah. even know. Um, the nigga, that, I ain't gonna. The nigga that played Franklin Saint might be a great. He Diddy. might be a great Diddy. Lie. I don't know he if he if be. he get, if he got some I rhythm about him, he can do it. Dude is a good actor. He's a great actor. He, he outstanding. He got an accent though. I don't know if he can. Who would be a good cast? He got an accent, off. but you didn't know, know that Diddy. Who be a you good? You didn't know he had an accent on um Snowfall. Like Carucci. Nah, nah. He sound just like a but West Coast. He can. I'm about to say, yeah. He can play. He can a, play a voice. He can play gritty. You feel me? But puff, puff more flamboyant, if you will. I guess he he get it popping. I don't know. But Antoine Fisher, the dude to play Antoine Fisher, he was he had that bop to him like. Sure. <laughs> hey, he know. was fire. Fire did he no cap. But it's it, man, I don't know. Who, I who don't else could know. who else could play uh Diddy? Um hmm. Yeah, other than Franklin Saint, I don't know. Yeah, I don't, and I don't even know who that is. From Snowfall? Oh yeah, okay, 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 <coughs> okay, 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 Franklin. Yeah. On some lifetime shit, they get uh <laughs> DC Young Fly. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even see him. I don't even see the him. Lifetime version, nigga. <laughs> hey, did y'all did y'all see Cameron on CNN? Man, that shit yeah. was funny as oh, shit. Hey, man. He went to, I'm, I ain't mad at him. He First said, get off, me up out of here. Do you know what he took, what he was drinking? Yeah. Dude, I'm asking everybody. No, I, I don't. That's his own little supplement. It's like his version of the honey pack is a shot that you take called horsepower. Mm. I'm about to go get some cheeks. So that's why he hit that shit and was <laughs> like, mm, excuse me, I'm about to go get some cheeks after after this on that horsepower. You feel me? Oh, plug this. Plug yeah, the, yeah, the, the whole that. episode. I'm about to get me some horsepower. That's y'all crazy. Not even, y'all not even talking to me about my show that comes on at 8 o'clock every morning <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> it is what it is with my brother Mace. But why why would you bring Cameron on on there to pressure him about Diddy? The wrong one. That's, I don't get. Like who man. told them to get Cameron? Yeah, that's what he said. He said, "Who booked this? They <laughs> yeah. booked me for this." Yeah, hey, he probably just got that somebody said, got got the people Diddy mixed up fuck? and probably yeah, meant probably to get, meant to get Mace. Mace. Yeah, yeah, facts. That's terrible. Hey, he got that little bag to go on there and plug his shit. And what? Just went viral real quick. I don't know nothing about it. <laughs> hey, no he reason. was hilarious. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Hey. That shit was funny as fuck. I fuck with Cam. <laughs> but Cam it's like, ride. why get him on there? It's like it, it, it's like they want to see us just sit up there and drag each other, bro. Like, that, that's that's all it is at the end of the day. uh, It didn't matter who the fuck they called. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just they want to see us talk about us, us. us talk about us mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying type shit like and then there was a black woman that was asking the questions that was the funny mm-hmm. <laughs> that's the mm. irony of it all. it's like like what dave Chappelle said when um he was like man the twin towers went down and the cnn want to talk to job ja rule like where the fuck's god ja? like who the fuck cares what ja yeah, rule like what ja rule like, thinks man, what? Yeah, who the fuck? Don't nobody give a fuck what Ja Rule thinks in the time of crisis. Like, oh my God, the towers fell. Let's call Ja. No. It's He's murder. Said, oh. yeah, this is it's a lot of murder. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yo, I'm sorry. We're not laughing at anybody that died during 9 11 or, you know, nothing like that. But at this point, y'all got to be able to take a joke or two. Yeah, fucking with the cut different network. <laughs> cut different network. <laughs> Big jerkers. <laughs> All right, so 